Do a little quick video here on this little truck I've been working on that I got here a few weeks ago. Uh, it's a 1982 Datsun 720 King Cab pickup truck. It, uh, it's in pretty good shape for a 30 something year old truck I thought. These little Jap trucks are pretty tough little machines. I've done some cosmetic stuff to it here recently and a few other things. Nothing really mechanical. Well, I did put a carburetor on it, but that was just because I wanted to. Uh, truck's in pretty good shape. Like I said, for an 82. Only other thing I've done that's really substantial as far as mechanical or not really mechanical but as far as actual something extensive to, to repairs I put a floor pan patch in on the passenger side it was rusted out pretty damn bad and that was that was about the worst thing I've done to it but uh, I got that all patched and repaired and it's solid as a rock now so I've done some other stuff on and off you see the beds pretty solid there's no rust in it I put me in a set of seats the ones that was in it were not too great so I put a set out of a late 90s model Maxima Nissan Maxima uh, they sit pretty good and I put me some seat covers over them some real tree brand steering wheel cover as you can see the floor mats there just to spruce it up a little uh, trucks actually got a little over 117,000 miles had 116,000 on it when I got it everything's pretty much original even the old original factory radio and it, it's, it works everything works on it uh, sounds good for an old radio it's five speed. Oh yeah, I put me a camo shifter boot in. <laughs> it was better than nothing at all, because that's what was there. Nothing at all. Um, I put down new carpet. I don't know if you really tell. I need to vacuum it. But uh, I put down new carpet and everything in it. And down in the back, new carpet. I took this jump seat out for room jump seat in the back is still there you can see it or not there it is it kind of folds down like so oh I put me in some cup holders I had these little steel cup holders laying around because back then they didn't know what a damn cup holder was I don't guess one there one there uh, see the door panels there jam up shape there's no rips or tears nothing missing I said the dash is real good shape not a single crack nowhere this truck was a one owner I'm the second owner of it believe it or not uh, like I said I did put a carburetor on it and I went with a nice little Weber setup better than it did Man, it's really windy out here today uh, yeah you see it's a uh, uh, see you can see it down in there Weber yep and like I said it runs like a sewing machine the carburetor helped a lot as far as the uh, the running part, the mechanics of it and all, it runs a whole lot better than that factory car. I mean, you just bump the key and it starts right up. It's got the 2.2 .2 liter Z. 
code engine. Seems a little V on it now. So that Weber does a fantastic job. The only thing I did have to do after I had it put on, uh, I did have to add me a little spring, if you see it or not, right here to go to the butterfly in the back of the car over here because there was not enough tension to completely close back the butterfly mechanism on the carburetor and it was causing it to idle high and uh, diesel whenever you would shut it off but uh, that little spring eliminated that problem and also it stiffened up the, the uh, gas pedal which was definitely needed because it was it was so weak when you press the gas it just man it, it was it was ridiculous you could breathe on it and it go to the floor uh, but uh see it runs good tachometer still works all the gauges work uh like i said the carburetor did help as far as it running a lot better but I think it diminished a little of my gas mileage. I could already tell it doesn't get quite the gas miles that it once did. So that sucks for me. But uh, you win some, you lose some. I've been told as it breaks in, it'll get a little better. But I don't know. I kind of got my doubts. But anyway, it's, it's a uh, pretty much factory setup other than the carburetor I hadn't really done much to it um, like I said it's got the see the can't really get a good view of that but uh, see all the information here emission control and all that timing uh, everything up there like I said you see the Z 22s here, but uh, it uh, runs really good. Little Dobson. Hope you like.